G'day. In today's video, I'm just going to briefly go over a method to actually clean your laptop screen. If you have a microfiber cloth or some tissue or some tissues, then that should be suitable. Or a glasses cleaning cloth would also be preferred. Don't use anything like metho or isopropyl alcohol that will damage the display. Best thing you could probably use is something like Windex. Or what I've got here is just a reduced vinegar solution, which Basically, even a little bit of misty water on a cloth will work perfectly fine as well. So what I'm going to do is just use cloth one, then there's cloth two, cloth one, I'm going to spray directly onto it. Don't spray directly onto the screen, as you may oversaturate it and then have it, essentially your solution go into the bottom of the screen and damage it. What I usually do is just buff it in a circular motion. Then go back and forth a few times. And then what you want to do is either switch to the dry end of your cloth or switch to a glasses cleaning cloth. And then just proceed to do the same style of method. You don't want to push too hard. So I am supporting the screen behind it. And just going in a circular motion. When you get to the corners, you can just go straight up and down. But I do like the constant circle motion as opposed to going straight up and down is that usually means, or does reduce the risk of getting scratches on your panel. Let's say you, there's a bit of dirt or a stone or something on there. If you're going left and right, you're going to graze it straight across. Where if you're going in circles, you do have the chance of just flicking that dust out of the way. And from there, you should hopefully have a relatively clean looking screen. You may have to go over it a couple of times. Another thing you can do is if it's fairly dirty is lay it flat and then proceed to clean the screen from there. But overall, you should end up with a relatively clean matte screen or a gloss screen. Hope this helps and I'll see you guys later. Bye.